crap at though. I mean, there might be another way of getting into another field if I have to, I'm not sure. On the other side. All I know is that they do come in this field. But there's lots of fields. It's awful when you've got to think like this, so, but when you've been chased, I mean, that happened to my mid 60s. They didn't really bother me. I was wary of them. But when. Once you've been chased and surrounded with cows mooing and stamping their feet at you, I tell you what, you don't have to move. And if you don't, you're going to get trampled. Sorry, I won't risk it. I might be risking it now. So I'm not sure where they are. The farmer here doesn't really make the path exactly cow proof. You know? He's put a gate in there. Yeah, I could have come up straight up here, look. But then I wouldn't have gone on the hill, would I? I've been up there before now. But because I'm not sure where the cows are, they quite often go down in the corner where it's shady. But I'm going to keep, I'm keeping. See, they can get through here. What's to stop them? Look. They've gone, they're on the mission those cows. So that's the field I've just come out of. But we've done the hill now. We'll be going downhill. Okay, so we'll be going downhill, shall Yeah. I think somebody in Spitfire perhaps in dive bombing or something. I tell you, that stinks. It really made me feel sick all day. It's not only the bloody. Yeah, that lovely view then. So that's the quarry. That's probably what's left of Callow Hill, this side. Ship them over there. Winds come right over the top there. Cheddar this way. <sighs> See if a cow suddenly wander through here, look what you've got to get over. <sighs> if there's time, I'll buy myself a cold drink of orange. Orange aid. That's my that's what I treat myself to, orange aid. I love it. Tango. Really does it. More than Coke. Because it's not as sweet as Coke. I find Coke. I bought a Coke. It was just like drinking a glass of sugar. It was horrible. Didn't have the same feeling of real Coke. Could be farmers working down here. What do you want to do? Do you want to just stop here for a minute? Or do you want to get to the gate? Let's get to the gate. Right, right over in the distance. Above a bunch of trees, it's customary. But like I say, you won't see it. It won't come out. Been in the mist all day. I can see Raycott's lights. Oh, and this is beautiful. I love this scene. You imagine if the quarry decided we're going to dig up this hill. That's what it was like over Callow Hill. They chose a hill. It was really pretty though. It had so many pretty trees. It was peaceful. And you can imagine the ancients were there with their a little fire. 
Now we keep our fingers crossed that we can get down here without a cow in sight to the gate. Otherwise it would have been beneficial to have got in there and worked out how to get down into the lane. You know? But they've been let out. It's always a risk, but and they do like it down there. I've often crept past them. Have you? Yeah. When I've been coming down here, someone's got a, a bike. You might have been herding the cow somewhere. It's not really far, but they often do. I think it's a shelter or something. Look at these lovely empty fields that the farmer doesn't like you going on. And they know. They're very protective of their their farm here but there used to be a stronger barrier here to stop the cows coming through <clears throat> I don't want to keep going on about cows either if you don't mind I think it's flashing because it's going to be just take a picture of that sea. it's a nice field a lovely sky. There's something going on down there, isn't there? Got to open on my track. There's a lot of rumbling going on down there. Is there? Yeah. I can't see no cows out. It might be something to do with the banger race in place. Not a cow in sight, that. Isn't it lovely though and peaceful here? What a lovely lane, isn't it? I'm going to need a drink in a minute. That insecticide is making me feel thirsty and it tastes horrible. I wonder what that noise is. There is another quarry, by the way. It's sort of partially used, I think. That's what I can hear. Can you? Yeah. It's not on your track, Sheila. It's the, another... I don't know what they do in there, but... Um, I think it's still partially used. Now, say there was cows in there and they started to come this way. You could get over a gate here. If you had to. It's always good when you're out to look for the escape routes because look here this, do you reckon this is where they let them in or took them out look bike marks that's, that's a farmer on a bike look they've either taken them out this way so where the hell are they then let's just have a quick look around the corner see I could have walked and gone on that little hill no sign of them look no sign of them Probably in the other fields. I can't risk it though. What beautiful sight we've got. Beautiful, isn't it? Yeah, so there's Cow Park going this way or coming this way. Which ways are the hoofs looking? I know, they look like they might be pointing that way. I can't tell, but there's no cow pack here, is there? You know what I mean? Maybe they got delivered in a lorry here and then just let out. Look, this is fresh. Isn't that? See, they go on the human path. What you don't want to come face to face with is a bull. This is going to be a long video, everyone. But at least you're seeing the, a lot of the walk. That was on the path. In a minute, we should come to a small gate. Which takes us down onto the bridle path. It's an old road. 
Lovely fields though, aren't they? Isn't that lovely? Do you think? Absolutely gorgeous, isn't it? What a lovely scene. And these blossoms. Look. We're not out of trouble yet, you know. I've known these cows to be tucked in right down the bottom where you can't see from the top. It is a risk. I don't do it very often, this walk. And I have done it with cows. Believe me. I like cows. I do like them. Just beginning to see the gate now, at the bottom. Just beginning to see. It's weird how you get the old cow pack like back there though, isn't it? Isn't that, isn't that weird? And then you get no more. And they're not over there. Look, look at that cow pack there. Do you think they take them down the drove? It's weird, isn't it? Isn't it weird? I'm turn off for a minute. No, I'm leaving it on because I've got to wait till I get to the gate. Okay. I'm going to be fired up again. Just wait a minute. My neck arrest. We need to check the time when we get here. That could be an hour gone. We had to climb uphill. Look. Look. We're about, I'll tell you. Look. Cow pack. On this path. Foot fresh prints. Look. Did they let them up this way? They've come up from here. Imagine I'd been out maybe half an hour ago, they were walking up here. It is a risk. I always say to you, this walk is a risk because it's supposed to be public, but they let the cows in here. Whether they do it to scare people, I don't know. But I don't think the cows could get through that gate, do you? Maybe one or two. They'd knock it down. There we are, we're at the gate now. How did that cow get on that path? Look at all the marks of cow here. And there. Big, big cow hooves. And this gate is, um, really, I mean, it doesn't even work, does it? Look. I need to mend it. Permissive path, it says. Right, well, we're back where we were about a week ago. Where, in the first time in 2024, we went down to Cheddar. We're not doing piney slides, it would be far too long a walk now. So we're back where we were a week ago, this gate. I've been up over the hills there. I'm just going to stop at this log, have a drink of water, put the battery charger on this, and check the time. So, put that camera down, turn off. Right then, I thought I'd just do a little video leading up to the garlic track um, at the gate. <laughs> I did this walk a week ago and we did a, a, a different walk, not the same one. We came from a different route from Sanford and across and everything. We did a different route. But we came down this track and at the time I didn't know if we had time to do the garlic route. So today I'm going to, when I get through this gate, I'm going to turn down the little steps and we're going to do the garlic route because I think we've just about got time to do it and um, 
I'd like to have time to buy a bottle of orange aid when we get to the bottom because I've more or less used well I've still got three quarters of a bottle of water left but I, I do need something for the journey home but anyway we've got to the gate both cameras don't like the heat and they're both playing up and and we've got to this gate now we're exactly what we did a week ago um, I can never undo these gates for a minute um, how did I get for it last time? Um, let me just push it, shall I? Push it hard. Look, that's it. Push it hard. Right. We've come down from there. Second time in a week. Now, last week we went down the main track. Okay, so we'll just take some more pictures. But today we're going down Garlic Root. Beautiful. I have to turn it off all the time, otherwise it freezes. And this one was playing up a minute ago. This is, um, this varies this bit. Sometimes it gets wider as well. We've got to be careful of tripping. And I thought, yeah, let's do it, we're here. This new route, we might not always do this bit, but coming down through the, the old track there might be a way that I use more than piney slights in the future. Depends where I'm coming from. If I'm coming off, I might not always do piney slights because they do have cows there that I have to negotiate a lot. And then I've got to go down through that wood. The, I'm making the most of this because I'll tell you what, this is a very short lifespan when we get the wild garlic and it all turns to mush and if we have a rainfall it does as well there's a quarry behind that hill there it still has some sort of activity going on anyway so I'm videoing as I'm going along for a minute this is Sheeta. This probably will be quite a big video section today. Um, like I said, I did video it last year. I don't think it's any longer, but it is a bit more diverse, so it might it might work out longer, but I'm not sure. I'm not actually timing it as such, but there's lots of little. What you see if you, when you do this route, you see a little little other areas as well, you know, that you don't see when you're on that track up there. I think somebody maintains it, or it could, could be quite well used, this route. Or if not, somebody does maintain it. You know, because... Um, it's not all covered in brambles, is it? I'll say that, and I bet you anything now, I'm at a brambly area now, because I said that. But look at it over there, see? That's like, that is a bloody jungle, isn't it, in there? Yeah.